All our ducks back there. Gordy's still limping, but he should heal up. Chickens and our turkeys hiding. I just had the goats out. I put them up because they were being annoying. But they were out all day. I'm gonna go back here and work on these T posts. I got three of them out yesterday. Got like nine more to go. But I'm having to dig them out because the grass roots are like a foot down. It's even hard to shovel them out. I'm having to dig them basically completely out and then use the puller. I still can't get it up, so I'm gonna fill the hole up with water. Let's see if that helps. It's so loose, I don't understand why it won't come up. Even with the T-post puller. Let's see if getting it wet helps. This stupid thing is not budging. I can wiggle it left and right, back and forth. I cannot get it up out of the ground. I don't get it. It's hot out here too. And I cannot, I'm putting my whole weight on this bar. It's not coming up. I gotta get these up so I can put the horse stalls up. I got one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and two out in the yard, fourteen, and then a couple in the dog yard. Whew. There's my six baby ducks hanging out. They've been so quiet since the male's been gone. Just mellow. Still upset for losing over half their flock, probably. I gave up on these fence posts for tonight. I filled up each one of the holes with water, so I might come back out in a little bit and see if I can get it done. But right now I'm gonna take a break. My daughter was obviously helping me water. She always forgets to turn the water off. They were out all day today, roaming the property, so they're nice and settled for the night in their pen. You got Charlie, Rush, Zoe, Tucker's the little brown one, Abby's the little noisy white one. Hey Charlie, what are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? Oh. Bentley wants to be in the picture. And then the little club-footed chick that Anthony brought home didn't make it. So now I have two chicks that I bought just to keep them company. They were in my shower, but there's nothing wrong with them, so I put them out here. This is where I'll put the guinea keats until they get a little bit bigger. The little black one, it's kind of acting like it doesn't feel good. I hope it makes it. It was doing that before I even brought it out here though, so I don't know what's going on with it. Aren't they cute? And then of course, because my work is never done, since I plugged that other hole, I got another one here. Starting to puddle, so I gotta dig that up. Good thing I bought a second part, and it's still wet under that wood too, so I'm sure there's one under there that when I plug this one, that one will start really puddling too. So, uh, what's tomorrow? Thursday? I'll probably dig that up tomorrow. I'll patch it really quick. Everything's settling in for the night. Got our chickens over in this tree. Our big ones anyways. The seven. Our ducks are over there. They're coming up. Bentley's out. He hasn't attacked any chickens today. That's a good boy.
<clears throat> Our guineas are over in this tree. Ducks are right out there under the tree. They were coming up, but I scared them off. Turkeys have taken position up on the roof. Goats are all over munching on their hay, tucked in. And our two little babies are over here. Well, probably too dark to see them. But they're over there. Alright, everybody have a great day. And I will check in with you tomorrow.